So I and Michael haven't been able to get to sleep, so uh, we're pretty much awake. And so I was just looking over, um, kind of like at my channel, Michelle and Mimi, and I subscribed to um, our channel, the M M and M Project, and. It's super cool. I'm really excited about this. So is Michael because look, now you guys can go and look at our new um, thing. So I'm about to put up yesterday's vlog and we're just pretty excited about it. So yeah, and we already got three views and no, uh, no subscribers except for me, of course, but that's pretty oh, lame. <laughs> so, but Dude, yeah, we're pretty excited. We were like three views already, and it's only been up for 11 hours. Hell yeah. yeah. So. We'll take what we can get. Yeah. We're not picky. <laughs> we're not picky. So. I just wanted to announce that. It was pretty cool. What's up, Toby Dubs? What's up? <laughs> well, if I do, that's you. I can fur in my mouth. Right? Huh? 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 No, no, he's okay. Your <laughs> dog, Nova. Nova? Which is Spanish for no go. <laughs> Nova. Toby. Stop. Go, go. Get off the couch. <laughs> it's just, he takes it seriously. He's like, yeah, whatever. Do Superman jump. Come on, go. Get off. Toby. Come on. Come here. Toby, come here. Come here. Bam! <laughs> nice. That's what yeah. Michael's gonna be hanging out, doing things. Okay, there we go. Hey guys, I'm heading to work, so I will see you later. Hey there. Uh, this is Mike, uh, aka Dark Four Three Six Five on PSN. Uh, just give you a little bit of background about myself. <coughs> uh, I'm a gamer. I'm a machinist by trade. Uh, but my main hobby pastime um, is pretty much gaming. Um, my first system I ever played, <laughs> and this is going to date me, uh, was the Atari 2600. Uh, my mom bought me and played the shit out of Pong. Uh, simple game, but fun. Uh, then I went to the Atari 5600. And uh, on a Nintendo, uh, on a PS1, PS2, and a PS3, and wait for a PS4. Hopefully, it comes out this year. Hoping. Um, what I'm kind of doing here, I'll give you a little bit of background about myself. And uh, I've kind of been doing a little bit of experiment. I follow several pretty popular game ex gamers on YouTube, like Syndicate um, from the UK. And uh, Spider Bite from Canada on Next Gen Tactics. Um, really, all these guys, I respect their opinions, gamers. 
And uh, what I've been doing is pretty much trying to find, trying to get shotguns on zombies. I'm a big zombie player. I play multiplayer. Right now I'm playing Black Ops 2. Uh, love the game. Campaign's amazing. Multiplayer's pretty decent. But honestly, I do have some beef. A little bit of beef with a couple things. Um, one is they got a ranking system on zombies, and that's fine, and I think that's pretty cool. They finally implemented a ranking system when they started using their um, multiplayer engine for, for zombies, which is fine. But I'm going to show you something, show you some stats that I got on zombies, if anybody out there is a gamer and is interested. Um, and also, if you are on PlayStation Network and want to hit me up and send me a friend invite, I'll be glad to play zombies with you. Uh, Gamer tags, Dark Lord 365. But back to what I'm trying to get to here. <clears throat> I've been grinding on town now for, I know, three weeks. Uh, I've been playing six hours a day, seven days a week for the last three weeks. And these are my stats as of right now. And I don't know if y'all can see that or not. <laughs> That is my emblem right now. I've got the knife through the skull, four tallies, blue eyes. Over 90,000 kills, shots fired, 472 downs, 280, 280 revives, 97,000 gives, 279 deaths, 21,834 headshots. 2,887 grenade kills, 544 perks, 381 doors, 1.77 accuracy, and 1,208 miles. Those miles are pretty much runs. Um, played transit a lot, but not a big fan of transit. Um, I'm going to tell you why. When they implemented the, the game engine on Black Ops 2, <clears throat> Obviously, for whatever reason, at Treyarch, the, the game testers must have been playing a lot of solo and didn't play a lot of four-player co-op or anything like that on it because uh, there's been a lot of glitching, boosting, stuff like that on this game, and uh, pretty much kind of sort of ruined it a little bit, took a little bit of the flavor out of it. There's actually less cheating on the multiplayer side than on the zombie side, and I've got, you can go to YouTube and type in zombie black ops 2 glitches and stuff like that and just see just a shitload of people cheating which really kind of pisses me off because the whole part of having you know games are fun granted but if you're going to implement leaderboards on a game well then yeah you kind of want to play fair and that that's my thing i'm a team player I like back to what i was saying <clears throat> Part of the thing about the zombies that's fun is, is the challenge. You know, the challenge of, of getting to high rounds, stuff like that. My highest round on solo on time was 40, and I'm the highest on my leaderboards. Um, which is, that's average. You know, that's, I don't really consider that high rounds per se, but, you know, I'd say 10 to 20 rounds is low rounds, 20 to 30 rounds is medium, 40 and higher. And you're getting into some, some, some serious zombie competition. Um, but anyway, like I said, we're, what we're trying to do is we're trying to level up. And right now it's 5.40 p.m. And uh, level up time is 20 minutes at 6 p.m. my time. Um, and we're going to see what's going to happen here at 6 o'clock. So at 6 o'clock, we'll turn the camera back on and see if we've leveled up and got shotguns. And... Uh, see what happens and uh, if not then we're going to continue the grind and I'll keep you date updated as to what exactly when I turn to uh, shotguns on zombies and uh, we'll go from there. So uh, we'll see you here in about 20 minutes. Alright well it is 6 o'clock my time. Uh, zombie rank up time. Look at the zoom button. <clears throat> anyway um, as you can see, we're still stuck on knife through the skull. So, we're going to take a look at another theory I've got about that right there. Now,
I'm at 1.77 accuracy, and I've seen some some YouTubers uh, claim that <clears throat> I'm at 190 kills per down right now, and uh, they say you can rank up anywhere between 180 and 200 kills per down to get shotguns. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go back and play a couple more, a few more games over the next couple days. Uh, not using any ray guns or anything with explosives except for Mustang Sally, which is your very first pistol pack punched. If anybody plays zombies, they know this. <clears throat> um, we're going to try to get that KD at accuracy to 1.81, which means we're going to have to get a lot of headshots per game, high kills, high rounds, and uh, you know, see if we can get that to 1.81 and then see if. We get shotguns in, and then uh, we'll continue on with this quest for shotguns and see where we go with it. Hey everyone, I am home from work. Michael is on the phone. Say hi, honey. Hello. I don't know if they could hear you. Hold on, hold on. Say hi again. <laughs> so, anyhow, yeah, I'm on the phone with him. I just got home. And I see a little boy who wants to see me. Hi, Toby. Hi. Hi. Oh, where's your fun little boy? Oh, you're going to attack me. Uh, hi, Toby. Hi. Hi, Toby. Toby. Hi, Toby. Come here. Come here, buddy. Hi, Toby. Who's your good boy? Who's your good Toby? Okay, I'll let you out. I'll let you out. Every time I come home, he is really, really excited about me and Michael actually coming home. Um, it is me. Obviously, you can tell I just made it home. Toby gave me a great welcome home, Mommy. Um, so I just wanted to kind of tell you guys that thank you all for watching our vlog so far. I and Michael, again, are pretty excited about it. The only thing, like, we're still kind of getting used to it, and, um, and everything. So basically, today wasn't that exciting. I wasn't in the vlog very much because I did work an AR shift. Michael's at work right now. Um, but I just, oh, we're trying to keep up the whole vlogging every single day, seeing how it works out. If it works out great, we're going to keep doing it. Um, and I think honestly, like doing it every single day also allows I and Michael to get used to the whole like vlogging thing and, you know, getting just used to it. So I want to say um, we'll talk to you guys later and see you tomorrow. Peace guys.